Last time we talked about fittings and that fittings are pieces or connectors that bring pipes together. Now drainage fittings have a unique set of fittings with characteristics that we will look at today. Drainage fittings are commonly used in different materials such as cast iron or plastics. Now the plastics may be the white PVC or the black ABS. Those are the most common drainage fittings. Today as we examine drainage fittings, we're going to be mostly looking at the plastic PVC or ABS type fittings. But keep in mind that the cast iron ones that you can see pictured here are also drainage fittings and they're used mostly for commercial work. All right, so as we examine fittings today, especially with drainage, it's good to know what they look like. So you'll notice on these tables that we're going to see, there's going to be a picture of the fitting itself. Then there's going to be the degree of change when we're looking at elbows. We'll have the common name, that's what we say or what we refer to these fittings as when we're working. But there's also a description that is used by the manufacturers or when we're with the suppliers if we really want to detail what we're talking about. We will begin our discussion of drainage fittings by looking at some elbows. An elbow is a fitting which changes the direction of the pipe and it is described by the degree of angle which it changes the direction of the pipe. For example, we have a 90. It's called a 90 because it changes the direction of the pipe by 90 degrees. Now for plastic fittings, there is going to be a socket on each end of the fitting where the pipe can slide into or insert into the fitting. This cup-shaped end of the fitting is usually on both ends or even on a T. It's going to be on all of the connection points. However, you can also get a fitting that is a 90 degree angle elbow that has a socket or a receiving end on one side and on the other side it has the same outside diameter as a pipe. When a fitting can be connected inside of another fitting, we call this a straight fitting. So what we have here is a 90 degree elbow, but it's commonly called a street 90. Now please note that when it comes to an elbow, whether it's a normal or a street fitting, this applies to all types of fittings. We're looking at drainage today, but you can get a street fitting in copper or in other types of materials. All right, let's look over these fittings using this table. Again, you've got a picture to help you identify what these are and the degree. For example, both of these are 90. The common name for the top one is going to be a 90, but the manufacturer also uses a descriptive name of a quarter bend. And that's again referring to that angle that's created by the fitting. The second one, of course, we mentioned is a street 90. That's what we would commonly call it on the job. But you would also see the manufacturers refer to this as a quarter bend street. Moving forward here, we have a 45 degree elbow. We would call it a 45. The manufacturers would refer to this as an eighth bend. There's also the street version. So we have a street 45. Manufacturers would call this the eighth bend street. Manufacturers also create a 22 degree bend. This is just for slight offsets where your pipe moves over a little bit. We have a 22. It's called a 16th bend by the manufacturers. We also have the street version. This is the street 22, 16th bend street. Finally here we also have the closet 90. Sometimes these elbow fittings will actually reduce the size of the pipe as they turn. Most commonly in drainage, we'll see this used for a toilet, which is why it's called the Closet 90, short for water closet. But this is a four inch by three inch 90, also called a quarter bend closet. All right, that's where we're gonna end our little discussion on elbows. Please understand that there are still other angled elbows, like a 60 degree, and other types that may have connections that come into them. But what we've presented here is the most basic. So this really lays a foundation for you as you start dealing with all kinds of elbows in all types of pipe. I'll see you on the next one.